What's up you guys, Idea Fliptronics. Gonna be helping you guys out if you're having an issue with Safari not working on your iPhone. So you guys, there's uh, three things that you can always do to uh, you know try to get the problem fixed. Um, one thing I always recommend is restarting your uh, iPhone. A lot of the time, you guys, we leave our phones on for too long, anywhere from 150 to 200 hours straight. Anytime we do this, it causes uh, lagging issues and just cause software issues. So it's good a good idea to you know uh, turn your phone off every once in a while if it's been on for a long time because it overheats too, and uh, you know just messes with the phone. So try doing that, you guys. Even leave it off for a few minutes. Another thing you guys could do is um, you know go into your settings. Um, go into general, then go to uh, reset, uh, click reset network settings. This is something that usually works pretty well. You want to restart your phone after that. You could also uh, clear out your, um, you can clear out your uh, history and everything on Safari, which also actually works pretty well. So uh, just do clear history and website data. You might want to try restarting your phone after you do that too. So those are two of the common um, you know, things you could do. A lot of people try to do those too. Uh, you could try doing an iOS update, you guys. Um, that usually works pretty well if your phone's due for an update. If you guys just did an iOS update and this is, you know, now you're experiencing the problem after doing an update, then it could just be a glitch with the iOS update. Um, it's always a good idea too, you guys, to have a backup browser. I'd recommend um, anytime Safari might be having issues, just head over to uh, the App Store and, you know, go for uh, Chrome. I Chrome's like one of the best uh, browsers, you guys, and it works really well on iOS too. So try a uh, you know, Google Chrome is a backup browser. You could even go for Mozilla. I love Mozilla. But it's a good idea, you guys, to have a backup browser on your phone, on your iPhone. I mean, there's really no reason not to. So um, those are some of the fixes, you guys, that you can use for, um, you know, uh, Safari not working. And then, um, like I said, uh, if you can't really get a fix for it right away, you know, have a backup browser like Google Chrome or Mozilla. They're both really good. Uh, thanks for watching this video, guys. Please like it, share it, stay tuned for more, and be sure to subscribe to our channel.